basic education curriculum, technology and livelihood education, learner's activity sheet, lesson video, computer system servicing, CSS, exploratory course for grade 7 and 8. Good day class! I am your TLE teacher, Sir Lance. Welcome to a new learning competency in DLE Computer System Servicing Exploratory Course for Grade 7 and 8. Before we proceed to our lesson, let us know first our learning competency for today. Competency Plan and prepare for tasks to be undertaken. Prepare hand tools. Use appropriate hand tools and test equipment. Maintain hand tools. In this lesson, we are going to learn and explore new tools essential in performing computer system services and also the proper maintenance of hand tools. But before that, can you identify the feature first? If your answer is a desktop computer, that's correct! What do you think are the tools used to maintain and repair a desktop computer? Do you have these tools at home? If your answer is yes, that's great! Proper tool selection a hand tool is a handheld device that aids in accomplishing a task. It is important to know the proper usage of every hand tool in preparing tasks. To accomplish a hardware repairs, it is important to have necessary tools to be used in maintaining and troubleshooting a computer. Categories of Hardware Tools and Its Uses Basically, there are four categories of hardware tools. First, electrostatic discharge or ESD tools. Second, hand tools. Three, cleaning tools. Four, diagnostic tools. Electrostatic discharge tools. Electricity is easily generated by friction on carpets, tile flooring, clothing, hair, fabric, and etc. The friction of moving air alone will charge suspended particles and cause the build-up of static electrical charges on people and objects in the environment. Grounded anti-static work mats used with anti-static wrist straps provide the most basic means for the controlled discharge of electrostatic electricity. Example of electrostatic discharge tool 1. Anti-static wrist strap Protects computer equipment when grounded to a computer chasers 2. Anti-static mat Used to stand on or place hardware on to prevent static electricity from building up Hand tools Tools that are used mainly by our two hands to operate. Examples of hand tools 1. Torx screwdriver Used to loosen or tighten screws that have a star-like depression on the top, a feature that is mainly found on laptop. 2. Needle nose plier it is commonly used to cut and bend small wires and electrical wiring. 3. Wire Cutter Commonly used to cut copper, brass, iron, aluminum, and steel wire. 4. Phillips Head Screwdriver Used to loosen or tighten X-slotted screws. 5. Tweezers Usually used to hold and manipulate small parts. 
6 flat head screwdriver usually used to tighten or loosen screws that have a straight linear notch in their heads 7 flashlight it is used to provide light in areas that you cannot see well 8 hex driver commonly used to loosen and tighten bolts that have a hexagonal or six-sided head 9 crimping tool is a device used to conjoin two pieces of metal by deforming one or both to hold each other 10 punch down tool it is used to terminate wire into termination blocks some cable connectors must be connected to cables using a punch down tool 11 wire stripper a small handheld device that usually used to strip the electrical insulation from electric wires 12 soldering iron it is used to join two or more items together by melting and putting a filler metal or solder into the joint soldering stand it is used to hold the soldering iron 12. Desoldering tool. It is used to remove excess solder in a printed circuit. Solder. It is used for connecting an electrically conductive element. Cleaning tools. It is important to have appropriate cleaning tools when repairing or maintaining computers. Using these tools will keep computers away from damaging or having scratches. Examples of cleaning tools 1. Lint-free cloth Used to clean different computer components without scratching or leaving debris. 2. Compressed air Used to blow away dust and debris from different computer parts without touching the components. 3. Cable ties Usually used in holding the items together, mostly used in electrical cables and wires. 4. Parts organizer It is used to store screw, jumpers, fasteners, and other small components and avoid the small pieces to mix. Diagnostic tools. Diagnostic tools can be used to scan your computer's hard drive, check your RAM for errors, check microprocessor temperature, and give you information about any other devices connected to your computer. Examples of diagnostic tools. 1. Digital multimeter. It is a handy tool that you use to measure alternating current or AC and direct current DC voltage, electric current and other cable electrical characteristics. 2. Loop Back Adapter It is used as a testing tool for a virtual network environment where network access is not available. 3. LAN Tester It is used to check most network cable wiring. And that's it for our e-learning class. See you again next time. Goodbye!